Hello, Polly's the Best for UK here, and welcome to today's Game of Day video. Every day, February 2020, a different Commodore 16 game on my channel. So, today's game is Saboteur Commodore 16 version by Barney. Copyright Jewel 1986. So, I didn't even know that Saboteur was on the Commodore 16 with just 16k of RAM. And I believe there's a better 64k version, but this is just a 16k version. And uh, yep, so you can see there's a title, it's loaded. Now I couldn't get joystick to work on this game, it's keyboard only it would seem. So uh, for space to start, and you've got A to go left, S to go right. Um, semicolon to jump, and backward slash to duck and space to fire. Okay, so first thing you'll notice about this game compared to the other versions of Saboteur is how small the playing uh, area is. It's tiny. And the graphics are much more reduced as well. <laughs> I played Saboteur on Spectrum before and it looks nothing like this. This is very primitive in comparison. So yeah, very small playing field. So uh, yeah, okay. So you can climb up the ladders. You just have to get in the right spot or you'll jump. No, it says there's a knife near. Can I pick that up? Yeah, okay, I've got the knife, as you can see. Oh, I just dropped it. Don't know. Anyway, so, uh, yeah. Oh, oh, I see, you've got to pick up the the, the weapons to uh, shoot the bullet. So, I think you're actually shooting knives, not... Uh, well, when I say shooting knives, you're like throwing knives, not uh, that. Okay, so, we can go down here. So there's quite a few screens on the game, but yeah, like I said, the graphics are very primitive. If you look at other versions of Saboteur, you'll see what I mean. All right, pick up the knife. Right, let's go back up this ladder down here. I mean, it plays well. I mean, th th there's no input lag or anything. Um, sounds are very primitive, just little noises. Have some of that. So I just got him right here. So I'm not exactly sure what you've got to do on the game. Well, wow, this is a big ladder, isn't it? Okay, I just found a knife again. So you can pick up the knives every so often. Watch out for this dog right here. I presume that's supposed to be a dog. I think there were some dogs in the, uh, the, other, the other versions, so I presume that's their take on it. Yeah, so they've dramatically... Oh, you fuck. They've dramatically reduced the graphics and the planes area just to get it into 16k of RAM. Maybe not, maybe they could have done a better job, I'm not sure, because it just looks nothing like the uh, proper Duel Saboteur games. It is by, made by Duel though, I think. I might be wrong on that, maybe this is just a PD version, I don't know. I don't think it's homebrew, I think it's new. Uh, as, I think it's as old as the original game. So yeah, a uh, bit of Saboteur for you right here, so you can see what it looks like. I don't exactly know what you've got to do on the game, but, uh, oh shit! I'm falling down. Oh, at least it didn't kill me. Uh, at the bottom, you got your what you've held in and what's near, and uh, your pay and your energy and your time. So yeah, that's a bit of Saboteur right here. There's not much more I could say. I, and uh, I thought you'd like to see what the Commodore 16 version looks like. It's very primitive, very small playing area for the game. Um, very simple graphics. For that reason, I'm going to give this a uh, six out of ten. Still plays well though, just not not as good as the other Saboteur games. Anyway, thank you for watching. Goodbye.